Hi, Aaron Sylvan here with a quick pro tip. Don't forget the lighting. Why do I bring this up? Well, you're probably shooting with action cams like this one. I use the Kodak SP360. Let's see what it would cost to rent some more professional gear, like a set of five Sony A7S2s. Twenty-two hundred fifty dollars a day. I love this rental company, but my client's budget didn't have room for that. Okay, so we're shooting with the action cam, and in fact, the budget didn't even have room for checking all the shots as the day progressed. So here's what happens. It's post-production time, and one of the shots came out looking like this. Not a big surprise, it's an automatic camera, there are dark parts of the room and light parts of the room, and didn't really know what to do. So we can try and fix this in post-production by adjusting the gamma. Let's see what those results look like. The lighting looks somewhat reasonable, but the detail in this photo is absolutely terrible. The cabinets in this shot are the most important detail, but in fact, you can't see the individual pieces of wood. The floor is lost in shadow, and in fact, there are vertical details on these walls that are completely missing from the shot. So get ready, here's the magic fix. Boom, turn on the lights. For that shoot, we meant to use natural light, but this is so much better. Suddenly, you can see all the details in the cabinets. You can see the vertical lines on the walls. And the floor, most importantly, is completely represented here. Look at the original shot. The floor is totally gone and the cabinets are unpresentable. There were two defects introduced by turning on the lights. One is that the natural light version shows two basins in the sink, and that's gone in the illuminated one. The other is that we introduced two bits of lens flare towards the ceiling. But overall, this shot is so much better than the other, I'm really glad we thought to turn those lights on. So a totally simple fix completely saved the day. I hope you found this useful, and if there's anything else I can help with, feel free to look me up. Oh.